Wildcat Basketball Weekly, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union, home of the official U of A debit card. Get yours today at HughesFCU.org. Welcome to another edition of Wildcat Weekly with head coach Sean Miller. Cats coming off a home sweep of the Mountain Schools, and now it's off to the Northwest to face Washington State and Washington. Coach, two good wins over two good basketball teams this past week in Colorado and Utah. We'll start with the second game first, uh, Dusan Ristich. That's all I have to say because what a, what a day for the senior. He did. He had an amazing day. I mean, three for three from the three-point line. If you just start and stop there, you know, I think that's uh, – something that catches your attention. But, you know, it's really um, his confidence that's taken off is his hard work. I mean, he's a product of uh, four summers, four years, 400-plus uh, practices. And to see him score his 1,000th point, which he did uh, on Saturday, and also get his 500th rebound. He has a chance to leave here as the all-time winningest player, meaning that he's played in every game that, that you count towards the win. I think it's it's uh, he's been a part of a lot of great moments, and 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 also a lot of those moments happen because he's been a part of our team. So, um, Dusan, and you know this, Brian is uh, he's about as great of a kid as you can get. Uh, he's got two classes left towards receiving his degree, and came here with English not as his first language. Been away from home for a long time, and. All of those things, you know, you want someone like that to have success, and uh, he's having, and he's really having a great senior year, and, you know, we're anxious for him to continue. Why do Dusan and DeAndre Ayton play so well together, essentially both being seven-footers? Well, they're really both very unselfish. You know, they're not caught up in their own world. Uh, they're, they're about each other. They're about the team. They're, they're trying to focus on the things that they have to do to, to help our team win. Uh, both guys are willing passers and unselfish on and off the court. And, uh, and DeAndre's mobility complements Dusan really well. DeAndre's ability to defensive rebound uh, complements Dusan really well. And, you know, I think sometimes as teams have tried to load up against DeAndre, you know, it's hard to play a smaller player against Dusan. And that's the advantage that we've we've had. And we have to continue as a team to do a good job of always taking advantage of that throughout the game. Hughes is proud to have been serving the local community and delivering outstanding financial performance and value to their members since 1952. As a performer, my time is valuable. And I count on Hughes Mobile Services to help me run my life. I'm so glad I made the switch to Hughes. I love being a Hughes member. They're local and they give back to my community. Make the switch. Team up with Hughes Federal Credit Union by becoming a member today. Wildcat Basketball Weekly continues, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union. Show your Wildcat spirit with a U of A Visa debit card. Get yours today at HughesFCU.org. Off to Pullman now, Washington State is uh, towards the bottom of the standings, but and yet here's a team that shot over 600 three-point field goal attempts so far this season. So I'm guessing that that's going to be a focal point of your defense. It is. You know, we talked a lot about uh, Utah's ability to strike from the three-point line. You know, in the first game in Salt Lake City, they made 14 three-point shots. And for us to say that we won that game is remarkable. That was a big focus and we did a good job. Among the many things that we did or didn't do well, I put that at the top of the list in terms of positives that we made their three-point shots hard earned. As a matter of fact, a couple that they made really were just breakdowns and uh, maybe a couple of the others they made were tough shots. Uh, we didn't let them get going from behind the line. I think that's an advantage for us moving to Washington State because we just watched film with that perspective, played a game with that mindset, talked about how we did it well, and uh, now moving quickly to the next game, I think it, they have some similarities because Utah, I believe, is second in a lot of the same categories that Washington State is on the top of our conference list, and that is Washington State. Most three-point shots attempted, most three-point shots made, second highest percentage, and, and that's a dangerous combination because, Brian, that's also something that our team has not done well all the time, defending the three-point shot. Your team has shot the three-point ball extremely well this year. 
in a different way, a more selective? Uh, how, how do you, does everybody have a green light? I guess people ask me all the time, they say, well, do they always have the green light to go ahead and shoot the three if they're open? Is that your philosophy? We want them to take wide open, uncontested three-point shots. And, you know, some, some guys who have proven it every single day, you know, in practice, and I think everybody knows who those guys are, you know, you, you can maybe live with a quicker three-point shot or sometimes when someone's running at them. But for the most part, if you have a balanced team, you have good players, and, you, you know, you, you don't want to live and die by that three-point shot if you're us. And you think about the shooting percentages of Dusan and DeAndre their ability to pass and make free throws, it makes no sense to ignore that as a big strength. And it doesn't mean that somebody like Alonzo Trier isn't a terrific offensive player, but being able to utilize the balance of inside and outside, that's when our offense is at our best. Wildcats eight and one at the turn, nine more games left in the regular season. Starts Wednesday night in Pullman, then Saturday night in Seattle. And we'll see you next time on Wildcat Weekly. Thanks for watching Wildcat Basketball Weekly, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union, home of the free U of A Visa debit card. Get yours today at HughesFCU.org, federally insured by NCUA.